The power plant of Nandali has quite long history. Basically, the first unit of power plant was built already in 1961, and this new unit was forced to, to build because now these old units are very old. The new unit is so-called multi-fuel power plant, utilizing circulating fluid as better technology, which means that we can change uh, during the operation the fuel mixture of the boiler. We can burn all kind of biomasses and peat and coal and also gas from, from this uh, nest refinery. The target, of course, was from the very beginning that we have to increase the share of renewable energy in our production and decrease the share of coal. The target now is to close all coal-fired power plants in Finland and that's also the target for us we are thinking how we can move to other other fuels. The new power block unit, which we call NA4, it's a CHP power plant, and the target at that time when we decided the investment 2014 was that when we need to increase the share of biomass, we need to have another uh, solution where to get biomasses. We are close to the heart when it was clear that we need a system to transport biomasses from other countries also, not only from Finland. And that was the reason to build a new system. The system will transport biomasses from harbor direct to our, our storage. The benefit of the new system is we can increase the share of biomass. We can, we can transport 800,000 cubic meters per, per year. And that means that we can increase the share of biomass up to 75%. Perhaps later even more. Why did we choose PMH? In this case, PMH has the best quality compared to the price. We were quite happy about the, the system, how PMH solved our need to feed the biomass at the same time to the storage and to the boil. So the target is to operate the system that way that when we are unloading the boat and ship, half of that fuel will be burned immediately in the boil and only one half is going to the storage. And that was quite clever system PMH made there.